ഹലോ ഫ്രണ്ട്സ് വെൽക്കം ടു ഇംഗ്ലീഷ് ഹോർട്ട് ആൻഡ് ക്ലാസ് റെഡി വൺ ടു ത്രീ സ്റ്റാർട്ട് മിസ്റ്റർ സ്പീക്കർ സർ ഐ ഡി നോട്ട് തിങ്ക് ദാറ്റ് സോ മെനി സബ്ജക്ട്സ് വുഡ് ബി കവേഡ് ബൈ ഓണറബിൾ മെമ്പേഴ്സ് ഡ്യൂറിംഗ് ദിസ് ഡിബേറ്റ് ഐ തോട്ട് ദി എൻ്റയർ ഡിബേറ്റ് would be about the city transport but as a matter of fact honorable members spoke of what was happening in the districts also whenever the question of city transport comes up before the house people get excited because they see every day a large number of people waiting to board the bus i have already stated that no country has been able to solve the problem of peak our traffic in its cities but i may mention that frequency of buses can go a long way to help but at the same time honorable members know that more buses and frequent timings give a low return so some of the diesel buses have been converted into petrol buses in order to increase the seating capacity i am sure that when we increase the seating capacity in the buses the congestion will be received we also realize that there is need for additional buses for the peak hour traffic we shall certainly see what can be done in the matter but we have to look into the profit and loss account of the entire transport so we shall consider the whole question and see whether chennai city requires additional buses then there is the question of road rail competition coming up in the districts the railways do not like a large number of vehicles flying on the road this matter has come up before the transport advisory council which is meeting in delhi next month the government of india warned that the lorries should not compete with the railways as they are now state owned this is a matter which we are examining and when we take a decision we shall see how we can stop this road rail competition it is true that the motor vehicles taxation is high in our state some other states are also trying 
to increase this taxation recently a committee has given its recommendation in the matter we shall examine it and see what can be done if there is to be a large reduction in taxation it will certainly increase our deficit and our capacity to spend for the good of the people will be reduced to that extent but i shall certainly see if any relief can be given letter from murali and company lucknow to messages giri and company hyderabad dear sirs we thank you for your letter which we received today we are sorry for the delay and we assure you that we did our best to expedite delivery of the goods but there was a sudden breakdown of our machinery and we were put to great difficulties on account of that though we hoped every moment to get the machines in working order again there was some delay in doing so so in spite of our people working over time it was not possible for us to complete the work and deliver your goods in time we thank you for giving us extension of time till 1st october we assure you that we will adhere to this time limit we hope that you will accept our apologies for the delay and continue to have the same friendly relationship with our firm as in the past we wish faithfully